What is going on everyone and welcome back to Magic Kingdom. This is the start of our favorite time of the year. One of our favorite times of the year. Well, it leads up to our favorite time <laughs> of the year. And we are now celebrating the Halloween season with mm -hmm. some decorations, but you might notice there isn't much behind us, which is kind of disappointing, but hey, we're gonna go check it out mm -hmm. and uh, have fun today here at Magic Kingdom. As long as there's pumpkins on Main Street, I'm good. <laughs> So I think on first look here, as we take a look at everything that has changed since COVID, and there are just no Halloween decorations up, which I, I you know, we don't want to be sad and everything else, but it's kind of disappointing. Like, you know, we know that we're not going to get the Halloween party, but it sure would be nice to at least have the full feel of the decorations. But it is also still only the first day of these decorations. And I sometimes in the past they don't always have everything up to first day so maybe we'll get lucky and they'll put on more maybe so i know without the decorations being here that's a little bit different in magic kingdom what it really means for us is something entirely different and it just i know for me personally and i've said this multiple times before but this is really the kickoff for the holiday season and even though it's not the same as it has been in the past it doesn't really take away from the fact of the real true meaning that it has, especially for me and many others. So we've only got like 10 minutes left. We're going to go over to this one trick or treat line. And I'm going to get as much candy as I can in the next 10 minutes. <laughs> everyone welcome back to magic kingdom and welcome to the very first mickey's not so scary halloween party we're actually gonna get a picture here with the mickey's not so scary halloween party pumpkin there's nate and minnie so being that there's so many things that are like different here and that are gone this is like the one place where every time that we come to watch the actual Halloween parade, we stand right here at this trash can. And it's like, I know it like seems really strange. It seems like really weird, but you know, this is like what brings a little bit of like the normalcy to the ever like changing craziness that has been here at Magic Kingdom and Walt Disney World and everywhere else in general. But you know, getting to sit right here and then we're gonna see some character cavalcades come through. It kind of just helps to, uh, I don't know, just bring back a little bit of that magic that's been lost since the parks have reopened. Here comes Jack, Sally, and Oogie Boogie, which is awesome. This is a great addition to this year since there is no actual Halloween party. Here yet, we've got Mickey and some friends coming with Boo to You going on, and it is so great to hear because it's like, you know, that's really part of like this whole entire season and the, the Halloween party. And uh, now I'm gonna like sing it in my head for like the next five days. Oh, no. 
So what I was really trying to say, which I was failing to do miserably, and I ended up just giving up while I was there in the moment in Magic Kingdom, was that even though everything is so different right now and it seems like maybe it's not going to change or that we're not going to get the normal uh, same type of offerings that we've always gotten from Disney, understand that like the bigger important picture here is that things are still moving forward and that with uh, the Halloween decoration showing up here at Magic Kingdom, that only means that after this comes all of the Christmas and holiday stuff. And that is the time of year of giving and um, really appreciating our family and our friends and everybody else that we have around us. That is what makes the start of this season the best time at Disney ever. Like it's the best time of the year. And if you have the opportunity to travel now and come to Disney, uh, I encourage you to do that. It's different and you have to wear a mask and there's social distancing, but even in the midst of all of those things, we're still going to get a taste of all of that classic Disney that we've always truly cherished and wandered over. Josh, come tell me what happened. They ran out of candy. And more important than that, it is for us specifically, is the time of the year where we've always come down with family and vacationed and you know so for us that is something that we truly end up enjoying more than anything else is this season when we can create new memories with friends and family to enjoy and reminisce over and everything else until we all forget about it, I guess. So I know that this was a totally different type of video because you know everybody else went to the parks today and they've been trying to show you guys the very few uh, things that there is even to actually show. But you know, I wanted to make something that was a little bit different. I wanted to make something that was a little bit more, I think, special for us. Um, something that we really are kind of just trying to have a different look on things instead of just you know, being disappointed because it's not all that we are used to seeing and used to having. Um, it's still something and it's something that is moving us all in the right direction. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys are coming for the holiday season, let us know down in the comments below because it is truly the best time to be here at Disney. Even if we're not getting everything that we're always used to having, it's still going to be great. Have a great week, everybody, and thanks always for watching. We'll see you in the next one.